Hi, I just created this video for my sweet nephew who's at college and he got some uh, some strep throat. And uh, after creating it, I thought like, I'm gonna share this with everybody because it's a really, really good video. Um, so it's a lymphatic massage. When I learned this, the practitioner I was working with told me do this twice a day for a month and then just like once every day or every other day, like a few times a week for ongoing. Um, I started doing it recently and it is massive, huge lymphatic flush. You get a huge burst of energy. You have to make sure you drink a lot of water, which I did state and express in the video. Um, but for, you know, head and neck, if you're getting any kind of sickness or sore throat, it's really helpful, even just the first part of this. But I did also show him the, the whole full lymphatic massage. So if you are wanting to detoxify your body, if you are sort of upgrading to a new consciousness of like leaving stuff behind, letting go of illness, moving into vitality and health, this is a really, really great way to support the body um, in doing that and in, in, in establishing new health. So I am at drkimd.com to subscribe for future videos or uh, information I'm sharing for self-healing. And you're going to love this video. And if you use this, I would love to hear from you how you feel, what happens. Um, do not just do this right before bed and then go to sleep. Like drink at least eight ounces of water after because like it's a big flush and you don't want to get all junky and toxic and have that floating around your system. So uh, that said, enjoy the video. So this is a lymphatic massage. If you've got sore throat or congestion or even like runny nose, like anything here you wanna drain, um, I'm gonna give you the first part of it, which is what you wanna do several times today, especially while you're feeling sick. But I'm gonna give you also the whole thing because you can do this, I mean, I do it every single day and it's really, really good, but especially while you're sick. So, um, and you have to drink a ton of water like before, after, it's no joke once you start flushing all this stuff back into your lymphatics and into your bloodstream. So the first part is this neck, there's all kinds of like, you're just gonna do 10 times on each side. There's all kinds of lymphatic chains, little lymph nodes all throughout here. So you could put oil or just wet it with water just so it doesn't, you know, pull your skin too much. So over on that side and then do the other side. Same thing from the ear, underneath the ear and just like pull it right down. Boom, 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 boom. And then the second part is right uh, underneath the collarbone, like on the top of the collarbone behind it, right under behind there. You're just gonna like dig your fingers in there and just kind of like <laughs> grab in there and kind of squish it around. There's a lot of the lymphatics. Um, it empties into this area. So you wanna just kind of pump those out to clear out the lymphatics. Um, and then just tap underneath your collarbones. Take some really, really deep breaths. And then tap right on the sternum. So the thymus is underneath there, which monitors your whole immune system. So just tapping on the thymus. Now the rest of this lymphatic cleanse is not specific to the head and neck or throat, but it's just really healthy if you're feeling sick. So just 10 seconds of massaging underneath your armpit. There's a ton of lymphatics and little lymph nodes and little, you're gonna squeeze them all out underneath your armpit. So just 10 seconds there. And then come right across your chest. So for women, you're just like literally massaging the breast, but for you just do like a circular motion right over the chest to help clear that all through and then second side and you're just going to do like 10 seconds there i'm just going to walk you through the whole thing if you're bored and this is too much just do that first part okay like several times today while you have a sore throat uh, but you're going to do this and then again come right across the chest in a circular motion and you're just going to kind of like squeeze it out like it's a you know wringing out a sponge you're just going to press and compress so several times there. All right, the next part you're gonna do is right under, this also is super energizing, like you'll feel like invigorated. So right underneath your rib cage here, you're just gonna like 10 times squishing this point right in the middle. I do like an exhale when I do it because it kind of brings the breath out of you. And then right here on the sides. pumping and pressing right in those areas. All right, and then the next one is, if here's your belly button, you're gonna go right above the belly button and right below the belly button, and same thing, just like. So, like 10 seconds of pushing there. 
And then the next one is right in the midline. You're just gonna pull up, pull up. I guess I'll just show you on the skin. You just pull up, pull up, maybe like four or five times. And then sides, same thing. You start in the bottom and you just pull up, pull up four or five times. Sometimes if you bend over, it's kind of a little easier to do this. And again, you can use oil on your belly or, you know, wet it. So it's not like, you know, hurting the, the skin. Uh, the last part here, which is my favorite, is you get right into your groin. I do this, I'll like lie on my back on the floor or sometimes I'll just bend over. Um, but you're right, there's tons of lymphatics here. So you just kind of get your hand in there and just rub it around and massage. 10 seconds and you know the more you're relaxed like if you're lying on the floor and you just bend your knees you can really get right in there or just like sitting down rub in there to just kind of clean through those lymphatics drink a ton of water I can't overstate how toxic and junky you could feel if you don't flush with water after you've just like literally like it's like think if you're taking a sponge and you're squeezing it all out and like any toxins or junk that's in your system gets squeezed back out into the lymphatics and into the bloodstream you want to like like a waterfall of water to flush it all out you're going to feel so much better let me know how you do